Mountain Massacre 2018. Proudly sponsored by KZNR Vico and fueled by Buco Pantown. The coming together of three years of bikes, friends and mountains. On the road from all ends of the compass, local, out of Africa and abroad. Riders landed, helmets on and ready for action. The action kicked off at 9.30 a.m. and the riders head off into the mountains, unexpecting what we had set, ready, waiting. At Nyala Pans River Lodge in the beautiful Umco Valley, just west of the KZN South Coast. I expect some serious slippery conditions. It's looking very slippery out here. I'm scared. Uh, it's my first ride on my new bike, so that's even more scarier. Uh, I think I'll do bronze today, though. <laughs> My baby sister, you gotta watch him. <laughs> Shot clips, well done. Right, welcome to round two of the KZN Regional Extreme Enduro Championships down here at Inyola Pans in the Amkomas Valley. All we can say is, is what a day it's been. We've had a whole month preparing track down here. It's a brand new venue, a massive thank you to Dave and his family for allowing us to prepare here. And uh, be, let me tell you something right now, we put in uh, big hours to prepare this track and the riders have come back putting in some big hours to get to the finish line. Some guys doing a lap in about an hour and 40 odd minutes, some guys doing a lap in close to seven hours. It's been an absolutely epic day. You'll see the sand at the top of that copy there. It's about 1,200 meters above sea level. At that point, the ride really gets lacquer. So what do you expect of today, eh? Um, just try and keep it smooth and not try and make any stupid mistakes. Do you reckon, boys, you're going to be fun today? It's going to yep. be lacquer. Yeah. And then nice and soft. Yeah. It's going to be wet. Messy, wet, horrible, but fun. Yeah, oh, look, I think it's going to be quite slippery, but it might dry out when the heat comes in. So, but uh, then the guys will have good traction, but they're going to slip in the first few laps and probably feel their way out there and uh, they'll get used to it. Young Dylan Brooks of the Dynamic Racing team waits patiently for his fourth birthday, so he too can line up on a 50cc rocket. I think I'm going to win it. <laughs> uh, seems like it's going to be pretty technical. I uh, haven't done a silver before, so it's going to... It's going to be challenging, but I'm hoping, hoping to get a good result. Yeah, back issues. <laughs> Riders ready, but not ready for the surprise that they're about to encounter. Not only were they meeting the rocks and other challenges that we had set out for them, but Warthog, Giraffe, Reedbuck, Kudu and plenty cows roaming this amazing hunting village in the middle of this beautiful pan here in the Amkomas Valley. Can you give us one word to describe today's event? Oh, a massacre. Absolutely, a mountain massacre. Can't get a better name for it. I slid into a tree, Matthew Green stopped and helped me. Just had to scrum a lot and always good to come back and have a race where all the top riders have to push their bikes at least once. It was very treacherous out there, like a first lap of Romania. Yeah, very tough, eh? Uh, but really cool, eh? Very nice and wet. But, uh, yeah, you just keep going. 